tricks for searching your Yahoo Mail inbox. Yahoo Mail has some useful search operators that make it easier to find a specific email, even if you can't remember the details about it. Most people don't know about these email search tips, and they just blindly wander around their inbox until they find their desired message by pure luck or get tired of looking. But not you. Let's say I think I remember getting an email from my grandma with a recipe that looked interesting. I think it was an Italian recipe that used parsley, or was it Italian parsley? Was it even grandma who sent it? Where do we even begin? If I type the phrase Italian parsley, including quotation marks, into the Yahoo Mail search bar and click search, if you really don't know where to look, it's probably best to have all selected for the folder, it will show me all emails I have received and sent that have the exact phrase, Italian parsley somewhere inside them. Search terms are not case sensitive, so it doesn't matter if you use lowercase or uppercase letters. By removing the quotations marks and just searching for Italian parsley, Yahoo understands this to mean Italian and parsley, so this will bring up all emails that have both of these words somewhere in them. If you want the search tool to use or instead of and, you can enter the search terms in parenthesis, Italian parsley, will give all messages that have either Italian or parsley. But now that I've looked through all these messages, I realize that it wasn't parsley at all. So I can enter, without quotations, Italian parsley, the, means minus in this case, so this will give me all messages that have the word Italian but only if they don't have the word parsley. Let's try another approach. Maybe I'm pretty sure the email with the recipe I want had recipe in the subject of the message. I can search, without quotations, subject recipe to return all emails with recipe in the subject line. Okay, but if I have 1000 recipe emails from my mom and I know she wasn't the one who sent it, I can remove her messages from my search results using the same minus sign as before. Subject recipe from mom will return all emails with recipe in the subject that didn't come from mom. Now that I think of it, I am pretty sure that recipe was from grandma. I'll try checking all messages from grandma. I can narrow that down a bit by searching only for recipe emails from grandma with the search term from grandma subject recipe. And so on and so forth, you can combine these operators and, or, not, subject from in any way you want to find the message you're looking for.